Three, two, one, go! Go! Okay, thank you. So hey everybody, thanks for coming to the channel. I am in front of my wife's or family's 2022 Volkswagen Atlas SC Technology 2.0 for motion. The reason why I'm here today right now is I'm changing out um, these turn signals here. Uh, there are one of two things that are actually still halogen in the whole entire car. So previously they, um, previously Volkswagen had halogen in a lot of the parts, but they made them the LEDs, but they for gold, is that the word for gold? Doing LEDs for the turn signals. I have the hazards on. You see that's LED, the lights are LED, everything. They, f they forgot to change it or for gold or decided not to change it. So I'm gonna put these last fit LEDs in here and you should be able to see a nice difference once I do it to it and I'll show you how to change these bulbs um, there's another video I'll be doing how to do the rear cargo area bulbs all right so we'll be all right thanks for coming back to the channel if you haven't subscribed to it I really appreciate it if you did first thing we're gonna do is pop the hood open I had to turn off the hazards and now now I know those lights bulbs are gonna be pretty hot anyways what's cool that I figured out here it's a pretty easy mod Go. I'm gonna do this one handed. Once you get it one handed, there's a lever right there. It's got a hood prop. So I can do it one handed. So the turn signals right here, they're halogens. And there's two spots or two places that you need to get it at. Um, you can see it. You guys see this right there. You guys see that rubber? Zoom. This is the rubber cover. This is where the bulbs are housed. Uh, I'm gonna actually go on the other side so you guys see it a little bit better. Um, so on the passenger side, a lot of room. It's right there. Tons of room, so you just pop this off. So that's the housing access, I guess you wanna call it. It's rubber. And the bulb, you can see it sitting there in the bulb housing. You're just gonna be careful, it's gonna be. I'm right handed, so. You just kinda, well, oh, you just kinda pull on it here. And it pops right out. And you can see it right there. Uh, I'm gonna let it cool off or get some gloves because you saw it flashing earlier. This bulb's probably freaking hot. Alrighty, so this is the last fit one. Um, I actually have this in my Ford Maverick, this style, and it's pretty bright. These are like heat sinks, so it'll keep it from hyper flashing after so much time. So these are like can bus ready. So we're just gonna pop this in there real quick. Super easy to do. Grab the light, wiggle it, pop it out. All right, one thing to note, which is actually a good thing. So they are polar polarity sensitive. However, you can't mess up the polarity. Let's see if you can get the focus. You see here, there's a notch opening right there. You see that notch? And this side doesn't have a notch. You see that? So if you're trying to stick the bulb in here, let's show you the bulb. See that? There's that notch that we're talking about right there so the other side doesn't have a notch so without that little notch you can't stick the the bulb on oh i flipped it the other way i did you can't get it in there yep but the one side you can so polarity sensitivity is not a concern yep all right here it goes middle of the day oh He's angry. What's the matter, dude? So this is like when well, that's middle of the day, this is afternoon, but look at the difference. It flashes brighter and stronger. You gotta say that's pretty cool, right? Three, two, one, go! 
go! Okay, all the lights are on, so... There it is. That's it. It wasn't too bad. Actually, it was one of the easier ones to get at. Easy to reach, uh, easy to change, pop out, put back. So just make sure the rubber cap is on securely and you'll be good to go. Turn on the car just to show you. There's no hyper flashing. There's no hyper flashing in the front. No hyper flashing there. No hyper flashing there. And no hyper flashing there. That's about it. Just want to say thanks for watching the channel. Subscribe if you haven't. And also if you want this, you can go to the description below or I'm going to put a link up here as well to grab this by last fit. Alright guys. Peace out. Mm -hmm.